Og jeg får kun fandt det her. Med et dope dog. Ja, gå til slip på et samt spænding. Så jeg tror, vi er slip i en minut. Right, in this video, I'm going to show you part one of my survival pencil case. Okay. If you don't, I was challenged by a few people on my live stream to build a pencil case survival kit. So, that's what I've been working on since then. And, um, yeah, it's been very interesting. Very, very interesting. It's been good fun. But at the same time, quite hard. Because at the end of the day, as I said, it's small. It's not big at all. And um, I am going to challenge a few people. I hopefully they will be interested in the challenge. Hopefully you will look to see what they come up with. But as I said, this is only part one because I have ordered some bits, but I assumed it would have been in here by now. But no, it's not in. So I will have to basically... Um, Try and catch up, try and find out what it is because I only got I buy most of my stuff online, so yeah. But as you can see, there's the survival kit. Give you a little close up. Yeah, there's the Opie Dog. And on the outside, as you can see, it's my compass. It does work, it does tell me where north is. Yeah, so yeah, that's my compass on my survival kit. But I always have my other compass. This one here, always on me, in my pocket, so, at all time. Even when I go out with the dog, I've still got that one with me. So, right, let's begin, shall we? Let's, let's go for it, shall we? Let's start on this side. Here, I have a multi-tool. I'm not going to open it up because there's no point. You know what a multi-tool looks like, you know what's in a multi-tool. It's only a card one, it needs, it's slim. Here I have a foil blanket. You can see, there you go. They are good. They will keep you warm if you needed to. And if you get too hot and you need to cool down, you can cool down with it. Okay. I know if you are if you're new to my channel, you will see a lot of these foil bags. So yeah. I have I am I have to write out some labels. I have to finish off my fishing one. See, there's the fishing one. You can't really tell, but oh, uh. and when they're finished, they will be all sealed completely. In there, I have some, a couple of glow sticks. In there, I have my leader. There's my fishing line. It's not much, but it's creepy. It will be enough. There. Yeah. And in this little tin, yeah, is my hooks, um, weights, um, swivels, and beads. As you can see, yes, I am enjoyed today. Yes, I am on my laptop because this video I wanted to do inside because it's easier for me. Right, give me a second, guys, so I can put all this away. There we are, nice all put away. It's fantastic. So now, that's the fish inside, thanks. I'm not going to take this one apart because there's no point. This is the water purification kit. I mean, fine. The only thing I haven't added to this is some tinfoil because I haven't cut it up yet. I just haven't had, I just got, I haven't had the um, patience to cut tinfoil at the moment because my mind is just not with it at the moment with that. I have four. As you can see, four purification tablets. Here in these pill vials is potassium permanganate. Yeah, that stuff's fantastic. That stuff works really well to purify water. And that there will do a lot of water. That white thing in the background, where you can see, I'll point it up. That there is a reusable tea bag. I use that as a filter. And behind that is some coffee filters. So yeah, that like the water purification kit. What's in here? We'll grab the other one out. And this one, I'm not going to take this one apart because you've already seen this one before. Here's my small fire kit. I have a, a full jet lighter. I have a glow in the dark candle. I have a ferro rod in here. I have some fat wood. 
I have some tinder clicks, they're new, I ain't had them before, so I might actually use them on a video soon. I have a frontal lens in the background, that's like that, but what I like about these, they're showing on this side as well. So that's the fire side of things. As I said, it's not finished, so if you want, if you think I should add for someone or take someone away, be my guest. I have a small hunk of 36 tied bank line. Bank line, sorry. I have small silk number. I know it's, it's the only problem with this one, it's cracked, but it still works really well. So. And I have an eye sharpener. Right then. Now let's next, now let's talk about what I'm going to add to this kit. I'm going to add a wire saw to this kit. Um, that was it. Oh yeah, and I'm going to add a solar torch. I was going to put a battery powered torch in, but then I thought, what's the point putting a battery powered torch in? Because it's not it's not going to be an emergency torch then. So I'm going to put a solar torch in. So yeah. Right, I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna tag some people in now. You don't have to do the tag if you don't want to. It'd be nice if you did because at the end of the day, it's totally up to do with you. Right. One person I want to tag is Sue Nelson. I'm gonna tag you. See what you come up with with a pencil case. Survival kit. Not massive pencil case. A normal standard size pencil case. I want to tag. Give me a second, guys. New subscriber of mine, and that's Step on Survival. I want to tag you, see what you come up with, because I've been watching your videos and I think what you actually do is quite amazing. And I want to tag Dear Love Festival Costa. I want to see what you come up with, mate. So, as I said, this is part one. I will be doing part two when the rest of the stuff comes in. So, please like, please share, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. And remember, guys, outside is better than inside. Okay, I'll see you soon. All right, bye. Bye, 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 bye.